Hey everyone, it's Blue Lizard Jello, and welcome back to Blue Plays Elden Ring here in the mountaintops of the Giants at the First uh, First Church of America. And last time we uh, we killed a dung eater. I then had to ask around on Discord to find out if that's what the quest was supposed to be. And <laughs> no, no, apparently not. I had three seabeds of the curse in my inventory. I apparently fed all three of him, three of those rather, to the dung eater, and uh, you have to give him five. So there are more yet that I could have found, and uh, I didn't. Oh, hey, look, an item up here. And uh, therefore, I have ruined his quest. Uh, ooh, times three. Nice, that's a really good get. I'm not I'm not upset about it, though. I, I guess he does have his own unique ending, so it's a shame that I'm locked out of that one. But frankly, I don't care. Uh, he's disgusting. He is vile. And he he's about the only one who's motives don't seem somewhat ambiguous or up for interpretation he just sounds evil just just pure he just wants curses upon us and our children and our children's children and our children's children's children and i'm just not about that so anyway here are my stats level 131 pause it if you want to know any more uh, running the same build as build quote unquote as last time i'm kind of um I'm a little bit torn on what I want to do. Now, right now, what I'm doing is I'm essentially just going to beeline for the most part to the beacon, which is, uh, or at least should be where the map marker is for the mountaintop. But after that, I haven't decided if we're actually going to continue on with the mountaintop or if we're going to go back to the Grand Lift Rolled. Because we do have both sides of the medallion now. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I forgot to do something. I forgot to do something. Um, I want the... What is it? What is it? What is it? Ah, it's a torch. It's the beast repellent. Okay. Let's switch to that and let's... Uh... There we go. Now everything's going to leave me alone, right? <laughs> yes. Anyway, so... And I believe that's going to bring me... Or it's supposed to bring me to the... To the base of the Halig tree? Uh, time out, time out, time out. Does it only... No? Isn't it supposed to work... Anywhere? Do I have to be on foot? I thought I tested this. Let's, uh... Let's see if this guy is... Is deterred by the torch. Nope. What? Why? You're... You're not a beast? Does it matter that your eyes are a weird color? I kind of thought they were always that color. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Fine, fine. You don't like the torch. Or at least you don't care about the torch. That's that's okay. So I'm not sure. And I don't know... I mean, it definitely feels... Definitely feels as though... Oh, hey. We do have some enemies here. I don't want to run past absolutely everything. Feels like we are truly, oh goodness gracious, into the end game, right? I mean, that that's that's how it feels at least. Uh, you know what, just, just for safety's sake, let's get shieldy boys out. Am I still fast rolling? Oh crud, that dog didn't leave like I thought he would. But he seems to be maybe kind of crap. Oh hey, nice briars. Okay, that works for me. How about Comet? What is Comet doing these days? I know that we said that this does, well, FP wise, it's about the same. So I have another cat. Oh, run. Um, so Comet does pierce. Maybe that's just kind of the name of the game. You know what I could go back to is Glintstone Ice Crag, but at the same time, it seems to be counterintuitive given the fact that I'm in a snowy mountain region. Oh, I like their headdress with the uh, thorns there. That's really cool. All right. Shieldy folks, let's go. Yeah, so we got some fire monks. My goodness, there's so many. Uh, what do I have that can do big, big damage? Potentially my founding stars. That's, that's quite the hammer you have there. All right, let's cast. Grab. 
Oh, it's, it's that guy. Um, hard to meet friends. How about Comet? Yeah, Comet can be charged too, right? Oh! Oh! Okay. Let's get a twofer if we can. Back up, back up, back up. Ooh, have a little rock slide. Quick, quick, quick. Oh, that was close. Uh, shielded boys are getting absolutely pummeled. I'll be here just about dead. And that missed completely because you jumped over it. Good hitbox, though. Not too mad about that. Okay, shielded boy with one final throw. I like that. I appreciate you. Now, let's see if we can pull this one off. I just think this always looks so slick. Ready? Beautiful. Love it. I love that move where you use the pebble on one target and then switch quickly to the other one for the follow-up. It's just a lot of fun. Okay, here's Scarab somewhere. Oh my. Okay. Can I afford a Founding Stars? Yes, I can. Uh-oh. Okay. Now let's watch the magic. That was pretty cool. Oh! Uh-oh. It's less cool. It's less cool now. Um, let's do Stars of Ruin, because hopefully, no, that didn't work. I was thinking maybe some collateral damage in the back would happen. It did not. But still, Night Shard with the running attack is very, very nice. All right. I mean, I guess I need to go in there. And is the scarab up in a tree? It is, and it's not a flask one. It's not one of the teardrops. So what do we get? Prelate's charge. So the prelate, that is the big boy with the hammer. In fact, that looks like his hammer in the actual Ash of War image. Slam armor into the ground to create a surge of flames and charge in. Hold to continue the charge. Large and colossal axes and hammers. Sounds pretty cool. Okay, so about 80,000 runes on me. And I see where the map's gonna be. Oh my heaven. Is that another hero's grave? Darn it. <laughs> let's, uh. Let's hope that we can just ride over here without incident to grab the map, and then we'll come back and we'll check out that fort. I think that's the way to go. I think we'll do the fort at the very least. Over here. Wow. I never actually noticed that giant skeleton. Oh, and we even have a sight of grace? Even better. Bam. Okay. Mountain tops of the giant east. And there's an actual giant right there. So this is called Giant's Grave Post. What? Oh my gosh. All of this? Is that the mountaintops of the Giant West? Okay. Oh wow. Oh wow, wow, wow. Yeah, let's ignore you for now. I thought I saw a glowing item up here. Look at all the thorns surrounding these bodies. Hmm. I want to get a look at this guy. Uh, all right, I put on staunching bolluses. Okay. They're like yetis. I kind of dig it. I kind of dig it a lot. Okay, now that, if I'm looking correctly, yeah. So that would be the ancient Snow Valley ruins. That's where Millicent was. Not anymore. She's left. But she did make mention, I believe, of the Halleck tree. 
So I was expecting to see her castle soul, but now maybe next I'll see her whenever I take that grand lift of rolled into a new area. This doesn't look like a big fort, so that's good. Probably just gonna be one of those one arena type rooms, that's my guess. Let's just ride around, run around rather. I don't really want to ride torrent this close to the edge. I'm not very good at riding torrent. Um, there is, interestingly enough, a back entrance here. And I can actually get there. Oh, what just happened? That was bizarre. Um. Oh, you know what? I'm getting too close to the actual walls itself. Yeah. Okay, which is fine. Careful, don't go off the edge. I want to take that beacon off so I don't forget. Guardian's Garrison. Yeah, definitely not very big. However, I think there's still a couple enemies... Maybe right outside? Right over here, it looks like. Or maybe just the one. Come on, give me something. Give me a piece of your armor. Nah. Hey, I'll take flasks, though. Oh, there's still more. Including a fire monk. That's fine, though. Okay, yep. Um, actually, not what I meant. I got uh, I got lucky there. I should probably heal up, or instead <laughs> I just keep firing. Oh, because I am smart. Oh, fire mark armor looks kind of cool. Except it looks like it also has a dumb face on it. <laughs> probably the face from that shield on their chariots. Okay, now how about we heal? Hmm? Back up to full with our cerulean. Very nice. Okay, um, let's just go for some stealth if we can. A flame guard, interesting, you're named. I don't actually know why. But, uh, just for funsies. Oh, never mind, you didn't need that <laughs> much overkill, I guess. I mean, how was I to know? He was named. Alright, what else we got? None? Not a lot. This is... This is a weird place. Strange. see a ladder but why are these named that's that's kind of what I'm really scratching my head about right no magic all 
I'll deal that damage. Happily. Oh. Oh, okay. So is there a way up top outside? Or is that fort now clear? Guardians Garrison. I mean, it's bigger than it looks. There are some big towers in there, but how, how does one actually get up there? The inside seems really empty. Thought maybe I could jump up somewhere with Torrent, but remember when I even get close to it, it kind of fiddles away. What if there's a what if there's a cave maybe I have to go through? Sure doesn't look like it, does it? I mean, I refuse to believe a named fort like this just has this one little arena with some... I did see the lily there. With some named... And you know what? Is there a ladder on the outside? Nope. Is there anything down below to drop to? Nope. I mean, except this right here, but unless there's a... No, okay. Also, wait a minute. Are you able to even get back up from here? Or have I just doomed myself? No, no, I guess you can... You can make your way. Alright, let's see if we can get Torm back over there. Okay, what blatantly obvious thing am I missing inside? Well, I don't know. This feels like the outside wall, so that's not going to be it. Oh, <laughs> the ladder. The ladder that's actually right here. Whoops. Well, there's no lantern. I'm always looking for a lantern. <laughs> there's a lantern up top. Okay, fine. I should have seen it. Just kind of eerily, eerily empty. Right? Like strangely empty. something sleeping. Oh gosh, that's just a terrifying view. To just come across the giant skull looking right at you. Chief Guardian Arganthi. All right. Do you? Hmm. You have the ruler's mask on. Are you here for a social visit? Oh no, that's a... What is going on? Oh good, 85 damage. This is going to go splendidly. Oh, gosh. I have to get 
around you. I can't fight you here. Obviously. All right, that's that's decent. Oh no! Oh no! No no! Ah no! Oh boy! Yikes! Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oof. That's a. That's a lot of stuff I have to potentially go back through. Which obviously I'm not going to. I'm just going to rush right back there. But still. <laughs> Actually, no. I can go around the back and just kill what's inside. I don't know. Who is that guy? Why, why are his fellow guardians named? It definitely makes me feel like the invader. Even though they're not, they don't have individual names. Just the fact that they're given a title from the game itself makes me feel like they're trying to draw attention to maybe these people are innocent, and I'm I'm the bad one here. Which very well could be. Okay. So what I can actually do, potentially, is ignore all of them. And just get up here. Right? And there's a couple of guardians up here, I think. Ooh, I could use unseen form, maybe. Okay, wait. There we go. You kind of see me, you kind of don't. I'm gonna go with you don't, though. Here's what I think we're going to do, right? I'm seeing form. Because I really, really need to go kill these dogs first. Oh, no. Okay, so that works out nicely. Uh-oh. Oh, he's got flames. Oh, that's a lot of damage. Even through, even through this. All right. What did I, what did I just do? Something silly. All right, back up. Oh, that's more of a cyclops than anything else. That's weird. Yeah, see? That's such a problem. Okay, I got lucky there. I'm not lucky because I'm on sandbags. challenging little fight. 96,000 runes I'm sitting on. One-eyed shield. So is that like a, a cannon, pretty much? Trixum shield, made from white stone depicting a malformed one-eyed god. The barrel of a firearm pokes through the open mouth. Once worshipped by the giants, this evil deity is believed to have been slain by Queen Marika. Ready the shield, then launch fireball from the barrel. The fireball explodes on impact. Sure does. Yeah, sure does. I could have summoned here, by the way. Uh, I do see an item over there, but first... Gotta go and inspect these towers. Yeah, I don't know. I'm tempted after this fort, instead of crossing the bridge again, to go to the Grand Lift of Rold and see where that takes me. Giant's prayer book. Wow, another prayer book. Giant's flame take thee, flame fall upon them. All right. Kept hidden by the prelates who monitor the giant's flame. I 
wonder if Brother Corrin is still hanging out on that bridge. In fact, can I check? Um, uh, yes, yes, they are still on that bridge. Him and uh, him and Gold Mask are still hanging out. Okay, is there another ladder in here? There is not. Okay, then I guess we just go grab that one item, and I, yeah, I think. I think we might go do the grand lift. I don't know. I don't... The fact that we got the other half of the medallion here, and... Yeah, I just smelled their butterflies. And we didn't have to, you know, actually get to the end of it. Kind of makes me feel like that's the next logical step. So, disregarding this, because this is important. This is important. This is where we're looking to actually get the flame in order to burn the earth tree. So this, this could be... This could be it. Yeah, this could be the absolute end of the game, or maybe that brings us to the final boss fight. Or I could be way, way, way wrong. But instead, we're gonna go to the Grand Lift of Rolled, put those medallions together, and I assume, maybe, that I'm going to be given the option of which one I wanna use. Is Millicent here, maybe, hanging out? Millicent is not, all right. Do I have an option? Aha! Hoist the secret medallion. Once again, I'm going to be quiet for a cutscene that really needs no silence. my map but why can't I use my map uh huh hidden path to the hallig tree I was not expecting catacombs so we got a stake America that's the bad sign the summoning pool equally bad sign who am I fighting? What am I fighting in here? Maybe nothing. Beast eye quivers. Okay, I got some vulgar militia. Wowza, that's cool. Stop it! <laughs> Papers. All right, let's get out the dagger. Oh, look at that thing on the ceiling. What is that? Oh, he tried to get away and that was just brilliant. Now I have to check everything. What is that thing about to drop on my head if I go that way? Probably the same thing that's gonna drop. It's gonna drop on my head in here, right? Oh, they're land octopus. It is a land octopus. Uh, how about ice? Is ice better? How about a mighty shot with ice? But, let's just run, 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 let you drop. 
Oh boy. Yeah, that has such good stagger. Such good stagger. Oh my goodness. Yeah, that works out nicely. Oh, remember the time I didn't level? <laughs> I do. I'm running around here with 100,000 runes. I know it's not that much in the grand scheme of things, but it is, it's a level, right? No, actually it's not. It's not yet. That is silly. Yeah, go ahead and fall. Uh, I imagine I can drop down here somewhere. No, no, you can't. Oh, careful. Oh, vulgar. Didn't, didn't stagger, didn't stagger. Oh boy, that's a lot. Please die. You didn't. You didn't. Not what I wanted, but maybe that'll work. Oh, wow, that is. That hurts. Ah, no. Uh oh. No, that's gonna kill me. Okay, okay, okay. Relax, relax, relax. <laughs> Getting scared by an octopus and some Oompa Loompas. Oh. See you later. Yep, do your thing. somewhere. One of these days. One of these days you'll get it right. I believe in you. Might be the only one at this point, but I do believe. Oh, grave level nine. Oh, sight of grace. Oh, sight of grace. Oh, hey, what a sight it is. And actually, what we're going to do is we're going to wrap up by putting a point into faith. Yeah, I think we'll get to 20 faith. And we'll have to talk more about that next time. Thanks so much for watching. I'm on my way to the Halley Tree, whatever that means. And uh, hopefully I'll see you in the next part. And we're out of here with the octopus and the vulgar militia. Ugh. Anyway, see you then.